Ladies and gentlemen, this is your co-main event of the evening. Scheduled for five three-minute rounds. It is brought to you live on BN Sports. Our referee in charge when the bell rings, Bobby Wambacher. Let's meet the fighters. First, fighting out of the blue corner. Wearing the black trunks, he stands six feet tall. He weighed in at 261.7 pounds. He comes to us with a bare knuckle record of zero wins, zero losses, one no contest. And he fights out of Everett, Washington, Matt, the attack, Kovacs. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner, wearing the trunks, donning the flag of Mexico. He stands six feet, two inches tall. He weighed in at 246.3 pounds. He is making his bare knuckle debut, and he fights out of H-Town, Houston, Texas, USA. Ooh. Introducing Hurricane Ike Villanueva. Matt. Kovacs, Ike. 18 MMA wins, 14 by knockout. Villanueva, 18 Ike. MMA wins, 15 by knockout. Here we go. Our heavyweight co-main event is underway. Black trunks for Kovacs, the Mexican colors on the trunks of Hurricane Ike Villanueva. See Villanueva trying to take control of the trigon. While Kovacs trying to circle it, trying to find that angle. Both, both guys throwing their punches, though. 100%. One touch, one fall. Very similar backgrounds, and both men with the same type of enthusiasm and excitement to just throw hands tonight. Yeah, see Kovacs a little bit more jittery, trying to find that, create an opening with a little bit of jitteriness, trying to shoot some random shots while you see Villanueva trying to be more composed, trying to take control of the center trigon closed, and hold that positioning to be able to counter or even be able to set up shots on the offensive. See, again, that, that, that position creates that counter for Villanueva. Very nice as Kovacs tried to lunge in there. What I mean by position, he doesn't make exaggerated defensive moves. He doesn't say make exaggerated moves. He basically stays in that little window. Good little hook there by Villanueva. Big shot landed by Hurricane Ike. They called it a slip there. Wambach called it a slip. His son, Isaiah, plays football at North Texas. He's 6'4". 300 pounds, he's a right guard. Wow. He's got four daughters. He said, I'm a, I'm a girl daddy now. And Haley, his 15-year-old, is going to homecoming tomorrow, Dada. So he is going to show her date what it's all about if he doesn't behave tomorrow night at homecoming with Haley. 100%. <laughs> and a big shot again by Hurricane Knight. He stated that he was going to envision his daughter's date's face on combat tonight. A little later, walked back to the neutral corner, looked at me and said he's going to stay down. And he is right. I'm it is all I'm over. Here. Just like that. Ike Villanueva. Man, I, I would be under my best behavior and then some if I were going to homecoming with Haley tomorrow. I might cancel it. <laughs> hey, I love you, baby. Get GG. Coming home, baby. Nice performance by Villanueva. Oh, very nice performance by Villanueva, very composed. Kovacs had a very jittery style, shooting in and out. A um, little bit difficult to time, I see, as Kovacs well, is one of those guys who's so jittery that you, he doesn't even know how he's going to react. Yeah. So you, to time him is very difficult, but Villanueva stayed very composed, played that position game by not overcommitting to defense, just taking small steps, small positions, small defensive moves so that he could counter, so that he could set up his own offense. And eventually it got him in that position to get, get the fight over with, with the good shots and good combination. He definitely put the heavyweight division on notice. Yes. He stated that he will be the next Mexican heavyweight champion for BYB. And Kovac basically fought with that nervous energy of Villanueva was calm, cool, and collected. Valenzuela and Villanueva embrace. Let's watch it. Good, that was actually what, what Wambacher called the slip. I thought it was a good left hook there. 
Yeah. But undaunted, a couple more left hooks by Villanueva. He said, all right, maybe you'll count these as knockdowns. See, he doubles it up there. And there, uh, that was uh, a right hand. That was a right hand that actually got the attention of, of, uh, of Kovacs, yeah. Yeah, and then uh, he went down shortly after. Official decision, here's Big Mo. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Bobby Rombacher calls a stop to this contest at two minutes, three seconds of round number one, declaring your winner by TK. to Villanueva as he defeats Matt Kovacs in his bare knuckle boxing debut. Ike Villanueva, a very highly anticipated bare knuckle debut after a long career with gloves on. How do you like having those things off and really unleashing those weapons you got call hands? Buruchi, that's the way. <laughs> hey, if you know me, man, you know the shirt. I'm a blue collar guy, man. I work full time, I'm a full time father. It's that blue collar Mexican mentality, man. We never back down from shit. So as you want it, bring it, I'm here. I'm here. BYB. I know the roster's not behind it, but now that I'm here, I talked to Dada. Dada, you need a star. The hurricane's in this motherfucker. So let's go, baby. Already calling people out. You want to make a statement? We have a heavyweight championship on the line at our next show, October 21st in Rock Hill, South Carolina. I have a very weird feeling that you may be watching that fight, correct? Hey, the song I said they forgot about Dre. They must have forgot about Ike. You better Google me, because I'm not going for my Wait, whatever happens. Hey, bring it back. I'm back down for nothing. I'm here to get paid, take care of my family. Hey, just entertain. This is why I do it. You see this crowd? This is why I do it, baby. I'm here to entertain. I ain't here to hug. I'm here to bang, man. When we from Ace Town, we call it swinging and bang. That's what we do all day, swinging and banging. Ace Town style. But hey, man, God. Now, you mentioned your family briefly. I know you have a lot of friends and family watching you all over. A message for them? Man, my wife came at home. Man, my wife put me on punishment for three weeks. She didn't give me none. I'm about to go tear that shit up when I get home. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, one more time for your win. Hurricane Ike Villanueva. 